In question four, again, it is a typical type questions about estimation. Uh, they give you few choice. Uh, the best method is to follow the decision here, follow the requirement, and then we try to estimate one by one, and then we find which one match the given choice here. And one thing to clarify is about significant figures. We count from the first meaningful number. So all the previous zero, we just ignore it. We start counting from here. So seven here representing the first significant figures. Second here, third here. That's how we count. But however, for DP, it's totally fixed up by the decimal point here. So one digit behind decimal point is one DP. Another one is 2dp, so on and so on. So we have enough information that we can start calculation. Two significant figures, so we use this system, 7 and 6, we stop the digit here. And then we consider what at the back is more than half. So we should change it to 0 0.07, not 6, but one more because it's, uh, what behind is more than half. So A is not our answer. Part B is about decimal places. So 1dp, 2dp, 3dp. The answer should be 0 0.077 again. So this is not 3dp, but 4dp here. This is wrong. Part C, about four significant figure. Seven, six, five, four. And then we stop here and we check what behind is less than half, so we don't change. It's 0 0.07654, and then we don't change the last digit. So this seems consistent. C should be our answer. We try D also. 5 dp, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, until 4 here. It should be 0 0.07654. Correct to 5 dp. You may find that this look quite similar, but uh, this is not correct. It's because 5 decimal places, we must stop at 4. If we write six, the 6 dp here, then it's correct to 6 decimal places already. Because it's confirmed, this digit is accurate. So, uh, the choice here and the condition do not match each other. D is wrong.